Hey, good morning. Um, I'm gonna do a simple gear swap. It's an eight and three quarter rear end. Um, we're going to pull out uh, a set of 276s and we're gonna install Yeehaw 294s. <laughs> uh, most of you would probably say that's not even worth the swap and guess what, you're probably right, but it's what I'm gonna do. Let's get started with this gear swap. Um, I just wanna show you how fast, easy it is. I already got the car jacked up and that's obvious. Get it jacked up, block the front wheels, get it on jack stands, and uh, let's get started. Let's see if we can swap these things out and have it sitting on the ground by myself. Uh, and I can't hold the camera and I'm just going to record, show you what I'm going to do and put the camera down and do it. Okay. First thing I'm going to do is take off the back tires, 10 bolts there. And then I'm going to take off the, oh, look at that little guy go. <laughs> look at him. He, yeah, company, huh? All right. So the first thing I'm going to do is take off the back tires. And now we're just going to take our brake drums off. Okay. Set that over here. Now we're just going to take this hole here and we're going to got five bolts inside there and I'm going to take a, a 9 16 I believe it is, take those five bolts off that hold the axle in and slide it out. Uh, okay, uh, the little nuts are off. I, I just see this, I just get underneath that and lift up on top of the axle. If not, that'll stop your axle from coming out and I can't do this all at the same time and hold the camera, but I'm just going to set the camera down and pull it out. Okay. Hold it out. Okay, that was about five, six minutes, but look what I found. Rear wheel cylinder's leaking. You can see where the brake fluid was running down on the tire right there. So I gotta replace that wheel cylinder too. All right, okay, we're under the car. This is what I got to do. Drive shaft, and I think it's a 3 8 Hopefully it's not a 5 16 so I didn't bring one underneath here with me. Car is in neutral so I can spin this around. Got four bolts here that hold these strap, two bolts per side that hold the strap on. And then I just push it forward and let it sit here on the ground. And then I got the bolts around the differential. There's 10 of them, 9 16 You're gonna get grease out of here and you're gonna get uh, a heavy center section, about 75, 80 pounds. Okay. So. Uh, drive shafts off. Uh, the 10 bolts in here are loosened and I'm just draining out my uh, differential grease. Right. And there's the 276 gears, they're out. Um, time to slap the, the 294s in. And it'll just be the reverse process. I'll put the 294s in, tighten up the 10 bolts, hook up the drive shaft and slide the axles in, tighten up them 10 bolts and then you're then your uh, wheels, tires, and dump the grease in. Okay, it's sitting back on the ground, and we're gonna go for a test drive, and and uh, let's get on the road. Okay, so what we're doing is checking the speedometer. Uh, hold it. I'll uh, hold this GPS. What I do is get this up to 55, and then uh, see where my speedometer is. That's how I check my accuracy. So it looks like about 50, 51 is 55. 